What's going on everyone and welcome back to another tips and tricks video for the PlayStation 5. In today's video, I'm going to show you what is unfortunately one of my least favorite things about the PS5 and a couple easy workarounds that you can use to fix it. Now, as some of you may know, unlike the PlayStation 4, the PlayStation 3, and even the PlayStation 2, the PS5 for some reason doesn't have an optical digital audio output built into the console. And this can make it difficult if you're trying to connect a high-end headset like the Astro A40 or other home theater systems that do require an optical audio connection. So if you're like me and you want to use your previous generation Astro headset with your PlayStation 5, then I'm going to show you guys a couple of ways to do it. Now the first method and most practical way of connecting your headset or home theater system to the PS5 is with the use of an HDMI optical adapter. This particular one is actually from Astro Gaming and it's pretty much just plug and play. For settings, you need to make sure that the input and output device is set to USB headset and that the output to headphones is set to chat audio. And that's it. Once you have everything connected, your headset or home theater system will work just like it did with the PlayStation 4 with no noticeable delay whatsoever. And yes, you'll still be able to use the PS5's 120Hz performance feature as well as maximum resolutions of up to 4K at 60Hz. Hopefully later in the future we will see similar adapters that support HDMI 2.1 for 4K120, but as of right now this is about as good as it gets. If you want to avoid using an adapter altogether, then I recommend you double check to see if your current television already has a built-in digital audio output. If this is the case, then you can simply connect your Astro Mix Amp or home theater directly into your television with pretty much no issues. Now, alternatively, you can choose to connect the headset directly to the controller without using the Mix Amp at all. When doing this, just make sure that the PlayStation 5 audio input and output settings are set to controller headset and all audio. Then lastly, make sure that 3D audio is enabled, and that's it. So now you know a couple easy ways to connect a headset like the Astro A40 or a home theater system to your PlayStation 5. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and found it useful or at least interesting and if you did make sure to leave a like rating on the video comment below to let me know what you think and as always don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell for post notifications i'll see you guys in the next video